Work zones are rising fast and OPD is urging people to please slow down. 6 News Johan Marin reporting last week law enforcement cited over 200 drivers at several metro construction sites for going too fast in a work zone. With spring in full swing, you'll start to notice more construction projects in the area. This means more work zones and more traffic concerns for Omaha police to watch for. You know, people kind of forget they get in their own daily routine and they just continue to travel and they just kind of they don't worry about people that are on the side of the road. So it's, you know, anytime we can be out there to just to help remind people. Last week, OPD received a grant from NDOT that allowed them to put in extra hours to patrol various work sites in the metro. Police found Zorinsky Lake and 192nd and West Dodge to be some of the hot spots for speeding. It was like April 8th to April 13th. Um, we had approximately over 300 citations issued. Out of the 373 citations issued, 245 were for speeding through a construction zone. That's very high, and again, that's why we're there, to make sure that they adjust their speeds, and this is a, hopefully, you know, this is a deterrent and people will fix it. Speeding in work zones isn't just a concern for construction workers, but for drivers nearby. Raymond Nichols drives down 192nd and West Dodge almost every day. You got vehicles, you got sports cars, you got motorcycles that, uh, you know, they don't slow down. There's posted speed limit of 55 and they rather still go 70. And for many like Nichols, it's a headache. They're speeding and if a worker accidentally steps out of bounds a little bit, and they, you know, they, the worker's gonna be injured. But when it comes to speeding, OPD says there's zero tolerance. Try to keep enforcing them and writing tickets. And like I said, as, as we'll be out there as much as we can and try to be deterrent. On your side, I'm Johan Marin, 6 News. OPD wants to remind you that you can get fined double if you're caught speeding in a construction zone. Tickets can range anywhere from $10 to $300.